Hello guys, welcome to our channel Code is Arcade. In this video, I'm going to show you how to get the sum of the digits of a given number. In this program, if we give the input as 1, 2, 3 as a whole number, then our output as this sum should be 6. First, let us see the working of our program on the whiteboard. So now, let us see our working of the code on our whiteboard. Here, I'm going to create a function here with the name get sum with its main parameter n. Then inside our function, I'm going to create a variable sum and initially I'm going to give the value of the sum as zero. Then I'm going to create a for loop with digit as its loop variable in string of n. Inside our for variable, we are going to write sum e plus equals to int of digit. So you might be wondering, what is this? This is an assignment operator. If you don't know what assignment operator is, you can watch our video on assignment operators in Python on the top and right corner of your screen. I've written digit as int of digit and n as str of n because the input we are taking from user is in string and we cannot add or subtract string to an integer. So we need to convert string into integer so that we can add and subtract into the sum. We'll come out of our loop and we'll return sum here. And finally, we're going to give our input as one, two, three, and we're going to print by calling our function get sum. So what is happening in our program is initially we have given the value of our sum as zero. And here, this inside our, of our loop is our main logic. This can be also written as sum equals to sum plus end of digit. We are converting a given number into string so that we can read each and every digit of our number. So the first time the loop, it will go inside the loop, the value of our digit will be one. The value of our sum is already zero and the value of the digit will be one. The value of the sum will be one. Next time it will go inside the loop. Now the value of the sum is one, but the value of the digit will be two. So now the value of our sum will be three. Next time it will go inside the loop, value of our sum is three and the value of our digit is also three. So it will go and give our output as sum as six of these three numbers. Here coming out, it will return sum as the value of this function. And when we call this function inside this print function, it will directly give us the sum which we want. So now let us see the execution of this program on PyCharm. So now let us see the execution of our program on the PyCharm. Here I have my PyCharm window open. We'll go into our projects panel and we'll open a new Python file. We'll name this as sum of the digits. We'll write our code here. Get left sum and cool. create our variable sum here. Get the value of sum as zero. And create a for loop for digit in str of n. We 
inside this loop we have a sum plus equals to end of digit and finally we will return sum we'll give our input as 1 2 3 and we'll print or by calling our get some function in the print so now let us run our program here you can see it took the input 1 2 3 and added them together and give the output as 6. So here is our program guys. I hope you liked the video and if you did, please share it with your friends and family. And if you have any doubts regarding this video or in Python, please feel free to leave a question in the comment box. Catch you in the next one. Peace.